fire signs. This will be a general reading um, for fire signs and Mercury here. Pisces is sitting in Mercury. So it's all about your, your intuition, that runner chaser energy here, going within here, what's within. Um, most a lot surrounding your intuition and your dreams and the things that you know you care a lot about here um pisces being the oldest sign <laughs> the one who has gathered all the information here i am pulling the energy around your communication i am pulling singly for you fire signs aries leo and sagittarius and at the end i'm going to get some spiritual animals since we are dealing with mercury which is surrounded by your communication the information coming in going out what you're collecting all of that okay okay and when i say spirit animals i'm pulling this because Spirit animals, animals connect with us. They communicate with us. It's just up to you to understand what the spirit, spiritual animals represent and why they're there. The overall energy, um, I haven't even, I pulled your spread, but I haven't looked at anything. Okay, we're going to head straight into prayer. Dear Universe, we want to take this time to thank you for the love, for the light, for the balance, for the clarity, for the protection, for waking us up, for the breath that we took today. For allowing us to sleep, we would like to ask for protection, for love, for light, for balance, for clarity. In Jesus' name, love and light, amen. Alrighty, fire signs. What's up, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius? How you doing? The overall energy around you is intention. Intention is simply allowing the will and the mind to align and move in harmony. May I always focus on the highest. My intention is that all God's wishes for me come true. Okay. okay. All right. We are using um, the angel tarot cards here. And we'll be clarifying with the tell me tarot. And we got the energy out of the wild offering oracle. What's so beautiful about this that I have not noticed. A 52 card deck on giving it all to God. Okay. Okay. Bottom of the deck is love bottom of the deck of the angel here is two of pentacles could be dealing with the libra most definitely juggling trying to make a decision here there could be some indecisiveness here aries stepping into you first with the first we have the ace of air this is clarity. This is communication. This is truth coming in as well. Brilliant new ideas and inspirations. Seeing the truth of a situation, a challenging beginning here. Sometimes when God gives us things or lets us know, communicates with us in a certain way, we don't really want to accept it do we Aries but it's if God is handing it to us and giving it to us it's time to unwound out of those difficult situations and to see things for what it is okay and that's what's the first card which is communication and we're we're talking about Mercury right Aries accept what God has to tell you okay because it is time to make a decision okay what do you want to accept here? The seasons are changing. You can feel this change. It's just really up to you, Aries, on how you want to accept this communication and how you want to give out the communication. The second card we have is the Queen of Fire. This is Sagittarius energy, but it's also very creative. Look at all that light, Aries. Look at that. All right. Stretch your wings and fly. Don't underestimate yourself. Exert your independence and creativity. It's time to be yourself and speak your truth here. It's time to let the your, your truth come out, your creativity come out, your communication come out, okay? Be confident, warm, intelligent, and graceful, all right? Because that's what the queen of um, rods represents. She's all about what she wants to say and what she wants to create here. And for me to clarify... definitely time for you to, to spread your wings Aries okay some of you can have some beautiful arm jewelry as well but it's time to go after what you truly truly want and tell the truth about it the painful truth could be coming in about a Sagittarius here but it is what it is Aries okay you already were kind of already expecting this to happen Okay, the painful truth. You feel disappointed as you realize the truth. Now you are more aware and wiser. As 
when the truth comes out, the truth sets us free. Okay? Know that. Know that, Aries. Everything happens for a reason here. It's time to put the bull crap behind us. It's time to step in our new light. And it's most definitely time to get some rest here. It could be time to time to end things with the Sagittarius as well. Okay? It's time to most definitely step into your light and express yourself here. You could be dealing with your third eye in this fear. Overcoming this fear. Okay? Because there's a new beginning here. God has something new for you. A new beginning, a new cycle, a new sound. Okay. Leo, we have the Knight of Air. Leo, you could be dealing with an Aquarius here, but this is fast communication. Okay. This is in and out. It's also based around false communication here. Um, like false promises. Somebody coming in and telling you they're going to do something, but they, they don't. Or they tell you that they care about you and they don't. They tell you they're going to call you and they don't here. Events that occur with great speed. Take time to carefully review your options. Creative solutions here. Okay. Intelligent and tireless I can't even see the other words okay because <laughs> the light is shining on it but idealistic okay anyway stop blocking out what you already know Leo because you already know if you already know this person doesn't care doesn't want to deal with you then it is what it is here there's some, some communication coming in that you need to just accept and you need to speak your truth here shine a light on the truth okay there's some communication coming in that you or somebody coming in could like I said could be Aquarius and they could have like um some emotions towards you or you can have some emotions towards this person here but it's time to go towards the light and it's most definitely time to tell the truth it's time to speak up it's time to trust your intuition here your third eye will help you okay yep could be dealing with the Aquarius or Gemini or you could be trying to make a decision about who you want who's your true friends okay because there's a snake here all right Somebody is a liar. Make the right choice by using your logic over emotion. Sometimes signifies attraction and, rom and romance, okay? You know who you love. Don't be the person trying to take from somebody else. Make sure your communication is clear. Make sure whatever you want to eat, who you want to join with, who you want to be friends with. Make sure everybody knows. Especially if you're dealing with, in communication, you're dealing with Aquarius and you're dealing with Gemini. This is beautiful communication, this is beautiful communication. Let it be beautiful. If you don't want to be somebody's friend anymore, tell them that. If you want to work something out, tell them that. Okay, Leo? But you have a lot of communication here. Okay? If you're cheating, it's time to stop that. Because God is watching. Intention is simply allowing the will and the mind to align and move in harmony. Okay? It's time to slow down. I just want to get to know you, but don't turn around because that pretty round thing looks good to me. You won't notice that if you're, you're moving too fast. Slow down. Please slow down. Some of you are driving entirely too fast. Slow down. Get some sleep and stop blocking out what you know. All right, Sagittarius, you have the Ten of Pentacles. This is success. This is also ascending. This is North Node energy here. This is coming out of your South Node, which is the position of what you already know, the role you've already played. It's time to be somebody better. Okay, it's time to stop doing things that you that that come so easily to you. Okay, and it's time to be better there's, there's success here there's finances coming in a very happy family life financial security finding magic and the little things in life here yeah you could be dealing with a um an aquarius here or just yourself here but this is making friends this is um could be a new job as well working together for real 
It's a celebration, most definitely with your friends here. So you could be going into a business with your friends. You could be going on vacation with your friends, but it's, it's still beautiful. Sagittarius, that's beautiful. Time to celebrate and enjoy. The hard times are over. Possible celebration with family or friends. <laughs> I just said that. You need to express yourself and make sure you're going in the right direction, okay? Make sure it's what you want to do here. It's okay to talk to your friends, especially if they mean you well. It's okay to do that. Talk to your friends. Talk to the people that you love here because you are most definitely dealing with your heart chakra, okay? It is time to communicate and recognize who your true friends are, okay? If you're partying too much, it's time to let that go. Something that you could be holding on really, really tightly to, it's time to release that, okay? So something new can come in. Something new, something that feels better here. If it's time to have fun and it's time to celebrate because you've been you've been working so hard, it's time to see your, the fruits of your labor, okay? Let's get these spiritual animals here. The spirit animals, if you may see them, um, you may come across on TV or you may just keep on seeing the spirit animals. I'm here to help you. So I may pull a card of an animal that you've already been seeing, that you've already been noticing here. Okay. Take it as it resonates. This is a general reading. If you would like a personal reading, the links are below. Okay. And I will try to put the timestamps as quickly as possible. So you don't have to sit here and watch the whole video. Okay, Aries, spirit animal for you when it comes to communicating, okay? We have pig. Link, 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 link. The pig can get really messy and they, they don't really pay attention to what they eat either. So make sure you're paying attention to what you're eating. Make sure you're paying attention to the mess that you're putting yourself into. Make sure you're speaking and communicating in the right way. Okay. Fertility, abundance, and determination. Right. The pig helps attract honesty, leadership, protection in everyday life. It's time to pay attention to what you want. Don't be greedy. Don't be getting yourself in mess. Please accept what God has to offer you, okay? Leo, we have the mouse. You need to be careful when you see the mouse, though. It could mean that somebody is taking from you. It could mean that you could have a liar in the mist as well. So be careful about that, all right? Dark magic, disease, and theft. All right? The mouse is enduring, adaptable, great focus. It helps synchronize details without nitpicking, and it's all about observation, okay? And slowing down. Slow down. Because you, you won't know who's against you if you're moving too fast. I, I just told um, somebody the other day, if you actually told the truth, about what was going on in your life, then people could give you the right advice. But if you're out here and you're telling a one-sided story, you're not really giving the full truth here, you're not really bringing in what truly matters to you, you'll get only what you're giving out. Sagittarius? We have armadillo. Okay. It's about protection and boundaries. Okay, reminded to protect ourselves, physical and spiritual boundary, mind, body, and soul. Don't let anybody come and try to control you here. Make sure you know who your A1s are, okay? It's time to protect yourself and know where you're going here. It's time to put that shield up. It's time to ask God, what do you want from me? May I always focus on the highest. My attention is that of God's wishes for me come true. That's the only thing that matters is what God wants. Okay, when we start chasing after what we think we want, we can get lost. Okay, the roles suddenly somehow start to curve out, and then you're at a, a crossroad because you're you have to choose self will or you choose God's will. That's all up to you. Bottom of the deck is goat. Hmm. 
greatest of all time. It's most definitely time to step up and be yourself and truly speak from the heart and know what you want as well, fire signs. I've most definitely seen love and light. Um, I wish you all the best. This is a general reading. If you would like a personal reading, the links are below. The time stop. The time stops. Time stop. <laughs> the time stamps are below as well. Have a beautiful day. Love and light.